What's up guys? It's Bubba TV24 and welcome to the channel. Today we are in the game Mage Tycoon. We're back, baby! It's been a little while since this game had any sort of update and it finally has. And there are a few different tycoons that have come out and I'm going to show you some of them. There are three in particular, the Crystal One, the Necromancer, and the Virus Tycoon. And uh, I'm going to show you how to get the Virus Tycoon because it can be a little bit difficult. Okay, so let's get into it. So the first one we're going to take a look at is the Crystal Tycoon. And this Tycoon is earned by spending your gems here. It is, uh, I think, like 500 or 1,000 or something like that. And it is fairly easy to get. It's a pretty simple Tycoon. It is very quick. We've got some droppers here, some spells, and uh, a power dropper so you can do the stuff there. We're going to go up to the top here. Oh, not the top, the next level where we have some paintings, our armor and weapon here. There we go. So we got some cool stuff there. Boom, and the weapon. And then we also have a, another floor, which I think we go up, oh, shoot, this way. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, you want to see more like it, be sure to leave a like on the video. Feel free to subscribe, hit that notification bell. We're on the road to 10k subs, can't do it without your help. And we have ourselves a bedroom here with crystals all over, and then we have a roof here that has chains that are holding up a crystal here pretty simple let's jump in here and get the spells we'll take a look at them so i'm not sure which one is the you know the ones that are in order but we're going to go ahead and do it so here we have our axe here which is pretty cool we have a crystal drop which looks like that pretty cool we have crystal energy which it looks like it heals me that's pretty cool we have crystal shard okay shoots crystals out of the ground and crystal burst oh that's pretty cool too so those are the abilities for the crystals so let's go back in here and reset uh oh let's clear out the tycoon we'll go down here let's do the virus one because the necromancer i believe is the newest one so crystal and necromancer i believe both cost around 500 to a thousand gems and that's how you get them. The virus one you have to get in a very specific way. You have to, I believe, either get a virus chest, which do spawn, but they're fairly rare. Or if somebody else has the virus tycoon, what you do is you come inside of it and I'll show you how to get it that way. So here's the virus tycoon. It's more of like a virus in like a computer virus. We got the matrix and binary code and stuff. We go inside, it's a very small tycoon. So we have our abilities here. Boom, healing pad, our items here. Uh, so we have like this cool like cyberpunk sort of helmet thingy. And then we have a uh, glitching sword. Now in order to unlock the virus tycoon, you need to go into somebody's virus tycoon and go up to the pedestal here where you will then hit E or whatever your button is and acquire it this way. That's how you unlock it. And that's how you get it. Very short tycoon to get through. Let's do the ability. So cyber pulse. Uh, might be the ultimate USB crash we have cyber bullets which is pretty neat and then we have hack which I think that's the ultimate actually and then we have our sword here as well so that is the virus tycoon very short very easy to get through let's take a look at the final one which is necromancer which I believe is the newest one and it looks like an old house that you would see out in the woods um, that sort of thing. Why does this tree have a hat on it? Anyway, into the haunted house here, the necromancer one. It's basically just a giant house. The droppers over here are basically zombies and skeletons and we've got upgraders and all kinds of stuff and a bunch of different pictures and stuff like that. Let's grab the spells real quick. There we go. And then we have a second floor full of paintings, that kind of thing. But there are statues and uh, we've got some weapons and the backpack here. And then we have these generators in here that are zombies. They're making money for us. And then over here we have our bed. And that's pretty much the entirety of this tycoon. Uh, it's, it is a little bit longer, but it isn't very... I mean, none of them are like crazy long. Let's go take a look at the different abilities here. So we have Shadow Bolt, which... Okay, that's pretty cool. We have Skeleton Mage, which spawns a thing that'll shoot at an enemy. So in this case, this dummy. We have a zombie throw, so looks like we throw a zombie that explodes. And then we have Undead Lord, which, oh my gosh, that looks sweet. And it looks like it attacks this, like, zombie, that kind of thing. We have this uh, weird skeleton backpack, and then we also have a Necro Staff, 
which is pretty cool as well. But that is pretty much the entirety of the remaining tycoons. If there are any ones that you want to see in particular, be sure to leave a like on the video. Leave that in the comments down below. Feel free to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. I've been BubbaTV24, and I am signing out.